Okay, this is the StarCraft II book, Heaven's Devils by William C. Dietz. And it is a very cool looking book, cover art wise, and well, this damage is just from a book light that I use normally. Uh, this one here, so that's not something that was a problem with it to begin with. One thing that was a problem though was, um, let's see if I can find it early on. There was just a tear that, I mean, this was printed like a while back ago. I might not be able to find it. Oh well. Uh, yeah, there was a tear on one page. Probably something to do with how it was produced, but, uh, I mean, whatever machine that caused that problem would likely be replaced by now. Um, I do like the artwork in the middle, although I get a sense that it sh might have, the idea might have been full color and on gloss rather than grayscale and on matte paper, but it, it does look neat and you can sort of guess who some of the characters are. Uh, it's a pretty good book. Uh, early on there's some difficulties telling who's uh, the point of view character, but I mean, it's not entirely difficult. The guy's a good author, but it gets better as it goes along. I've only gotten like three-fourths of the way through. Uh, I sort of like it better than I Minx. I only have that on audiobook format though, but yeah, this one's a pretty good book. Um, not sure what it reminds me of. Uh, something like... It's similar to some of Asimov's later books. Like, it makes me think of Foundation and Empire, even though, like, the stories are completely different. It's just how it's told a little bit. Or, uh, not Foundation and Empire, Prelude to Foundation. Or maybe Nemesis, something along those lines. That's how it... That's the way the story's told it, how it makes me think of it. But, uh, yes, yeah, so I, I really like the StarCraft games, and the books are pretty good. But, uh, yeah, I'd, I'd recommend it.